So you can see I've got a large ruby vein traversing across the front of my thigh and communicating down to the outside of my calf. This vein's been here for a few years and I've just been keeping an eye on it with a yearly ultrasound through my sonographer. It draws a beautiful diagram for me and we get a map of all the varicose veins in my leg, how big they are and how many there are and I can keep an eye on monitoring it for if it gets worse or not. At this stage, I don't need to get these veins treated because they're not causing me any problems. The issues for why you might get your veins treated are you don't like how they look, you don't like how they feel, as in the symptoms that they can cause, heavy, aching, tired legs, worse in hot weather, worse towards the end of the day, an itch of the shin overnight, restless legs at night, sometimes cramps, and certainly swelling. Those are all symptoms of veins, which might uh, mean that you want to get them treated. And finally, if you leave the veins for too long and they get very large, say over 8 millimeters in diameter, is when I start to see more frequently that people are having damage from their veins, they can cause the leg some health problems. Namely, they start with swelling, progressing to skin pigmentation, and eventually tattooing of the skin with iron, which is leaked out of the blood. And then eventually that leads to chronic inflammation in the skin and causes ulceration, which are awful to have as a patient and awful to treat. So the goal of getting your veins treated, how they look, how they feel, or preventing skin damage and ulceration.